Hello everyone, Christina Poncher here for TopRank.com and we are at the Wildcard Gym for the very first media day workout for Vasily Lomachenko. Your first workout here in front of the media. How did you feel with all the cameras, all the attention around you? Я в принципе привык к этому, потому что я прошел две две Олимпиады, два чемпионата мира, и у нас в стране как бы тоже медиа присутствует, поэтому я привык к спешкам. It's not the news to me, so I went through the two Olympics, two worlds, so it's always the correspondents and the cameras was in front of me, so it's I'm already used to it. You did some pretty unique exercises. I've watched tons of boxers work out and I haven't quite seen anybody walk on their hands like you did and also when you tethered the um, tennis ball on the edge of your hat and hit that are, th are those techniques that you've been using are those things that you your father has taught you things that you've been doing for years во-первых может быть просто эти боксеры не показывают на видео то что это они делают а на самом деле в зале когда никто их не снимает они это и делают мне же это конечно показал отец и ну это часть моей работы it's part of my work and uh, of course it showed my father and talking about other fighters they might not do that in front of a camera or in front of a media workout but they do somewhere close in a, in the gym and they know nobody saw them you're fighting a tough competitor in your first fight in a 10 round fight something that even bob Arum said has been unheard of in boxing for for at least as long as he can remember uh, where all that where does all that confidence coming from i mean he's the seventh ranked fighter at featherweight in the wbo 10 round debut pay-per-view big stage but yet you're very confident that, that not only are you going to win but you're going to challenge for a world title in, in your second fight where does all that confidence come from я не знаю я уже в принципе говорил ну я хочу рискнуть я в принципе наверное ничего не теряю потому что для меня это первый бой и Хотелось бы просто попасть в историю. Я вижу, это единственный путь, который можно забраться там на тот Олимп и остаться в истории бокса профессионального. I'm risking, but I'm not losing anything. So I think this is only one way I can make a history, and I want to be there. I just wanted to walk through it, and I want to be a history in boxing. Bob, we saw Top Rank's newest signee, newest fighter, Vasily Lomachenko, in his first media day workout. Some very unique techniques that we saw today. What did you think of what you saw? Well, Vasil Lomachenko is a major, major talent. He's probably the most talented kid coming out of the amateurs that I've seen since Sugar Ray Leonard. Uh, you know, and I've seen them all other talented kids like uh, Delahoya, Mayweather, they were very talented and you knew or felt that they would succeed uh, in the pros. Uh, Ray Leonard, he, I was absolutely convinced was gonna be great in the pros. I'm convinced on, as far as this kid is concerned. He is gonna be a great professional fighter. What is it that you saw in him that made you say that? Obviously, he has a tremendous amateur background and his record with only one amateur loss, which was a contest, highly contested a loss. What was it that you saw in him that, that makes you say that? What I saw was a, a, a young man who was very successful in the amateurs, but yet had a very pro-friendly style. Very quick, uh, very intelligent, and could punch and was aggressive. Uh, people are going to love him uh, as a professional fighter, fighting with smaller gloves, no headgear. He's going to be a major attraction in the pros. A fight he may be watching very closely after his fight will be a fight on the undercard of Bradley Marquez, which is Orlando Salido versus Orlando Cruz. That could be a possibility as an opponent, uh, the winner for his first title shot, correct? That is correct. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we'd like to build on that. That's a really good fight, uh, Cruz and Salido, uh, even without the backstory. Uh, on, uh, concerning Cruz's sexuality, it's still uh, a, a tremendous fight, a Puerto Rican against a Mexican. 
uh, yeah, the winner of that fight, the new champion, uh, could very well uh, step in the ring in January in Madison Square Garden against uh, Vasily Lomachenko. A few unique techniques we saw from Vasily Lomachenko in his first media day workout, and we should really be in for a treat for his 10-round pro debut. It's going down at the Thomas & Mack October 12th on the pay-per-view undercard of Bradley Marquez. It's going to be a great night of boxing. Get there early and check him out, or check with your local cable provider and get that pay-per-view. Keep it right here on TopRank.com. We'll keep you posted on all the latest all fight week long. I'm Christina Poncher.